Hello friends, this video on determinant part 19 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 18. Now we will study application of determinant to find area of triangle. So if you have a triangle with vertices x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3. So three vertices, uh, three. In that case, we can find the area of triangle to be 1 by 2 x1 y2 minus y3 plus y2 x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2. The same thing can be represented in the form of determinant. Area of triangle is nothing but 1 by 2 into x1 y1 x2 y2 x3 y3 and you put 1 1 1 here because this is defined only for square matrix. So we have to make it 3 cross 3. And that's why we put 1, 1, 1 here. And thus we get area of triangle to be 1 by 2, x1, y1, 1, x2, y2, 1, x3, y3, 1. Please note this formula. It's critical formula will be using this uh, area of triangle to be 1 by 2, determinant of x1, y1, 1, x2, y2, 1, x3, y3, 1. And please note the area of triangle is always positive because the area is always positive. So we always take absolute value of determinant. So this is nothing but absolute value of this. Even if it comes out to be negative, we take the positive part, absolute value. We'll take some example for area of triangle. Let's try to find the area of the triangle with the vertices 106043. So here, if you see, we have this triangle with vertices 106 and 40. And the area of triangle formula is very simple. 1 by 2 into x1 y1 1 x2 y2 1 x3 y3 1. Now what is x1 y1? The first word is 1 0. x2 y2 second word is 6 0. And x3 y3 is 4 3. So this is my area of triangle. I have to just solve this. So if you solve this, this comes out to be one into zero minus three minus zero plus one into six into three eighteen minus zero. This is nothing but 1 by 2 into 0 minus 3 is minus 3, minus 3 plus 18 is 15. 1 by 2 into 15, that is 15 by 2 square unit. Very simple. We have the points x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3. Just put the points in the formula, find the determinant, get the answer. I'll take one more example because uh, we'll have to, uh, it's a very critical topic to find the area. So let's find area of another triangle with the vertices minus 2, minus 3, 3, 2, minus 1 and 8. Same thing here. So this guy is x1, y1, x2, y2. This guy is x3, y3. So area formula is nothing but 1 by 2, a determinant of x1, y1, 1 x2, y2, 1, x3, y3, 1. Correct? So this guy is nothing but 1 by 2 determinant of x1 is minus 2, y1 is minus 3 and 1, x2 is 3, y2 is 2 and 1, x3 is minus 1, y3 is minus 8 and 1. Just let's solve this. 1 by 2 minus 2 into 2 into 1 minus minus 8 into 1. Correct? Minus minus 3 into 3 into 1 minus 1 into 1. 3 into 1 minus 1 into minus 1. Correct? And then plus 1 into 8 into minus 3 or minus 8 into 3 minus 2 into minus 1. So this comes out to be 1 by 2 mod of minus 2 into this is 2 minus 
minus 8 2 plus 8 10 minus 2 into 10 is minus 20 minus 3 minus minus 3 this, this is plus 3 plus 3 into 3 plus 1 4 4 into 3 is 12 plus 12 this guy becomes minus 8 into 3 is minus 24 plus 2 minus 22 minus 20 so this guy is nothing but 1 by 2 into minus 30 correct and this guy is nothing but 15 minus 15 but we take absolute value, value always so I'll take the absolute value of this this becomes 15 unit or square unit 15 square unit and that is my answer so this question I took because the answer came out to be minus 15 and we have to note here that the area of triangle is always positive so we'll take the absolute value absolute value of minus 15 is 15 thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thanks once again